I wanted to show you guys this 12.8 portable monitor screen. It's pretty awesome. It actually does have a keyboard as well. And so you have this really big screen, but then you also have this keyboard right here and I'll show you guys what it comes with and then I'll show you guys it in use. It's a pretty cool product. It does close, you know, like this. So that way you can easily take it with you on the go. But it's a cool little screen because it allows you to be able to essentially just add an external monitor to your laptop, to your PC, to your other monitors, and it just allows you to have a little screen. You know, if you do have a computer in the background or a monitor, you can have this one below, which is really nice. And it's completely touchscreen as well. So you can have your main monitor up there and then you can have a touchscreen thing right here to edit your videos or just to watch videos down here while you're editing on the big screen. You know, there's a lot of possibilities with this and because it connects, to your monitor, you can actually use this as the keyboard as well. And I'll show you guys right here. So on the back, you do have two Type-C inputs. And essentially for the most part, you can just plug this into your monitor and you don't need any external power source. If you do just have a computer monitor, which I have, it's all in one computer, you know, with the screen and everything, then you will need to actually plug in an external power source and then you plug this into the actual computer. And so I'll show you guys how to do that. If you do just have a monitor though, and the monitor already has a power source, then you should just be able to do USB-C to the USB-A cable and plug it directly into that monitor and then you'll have power and it should be good to go. But as far as what it comes with, you do get a manual right here. It tells you how to set it up depending on what kind of computer you have. If you have a PC, you know, a MacBook or a Windows, it'll tell you how to set it up, which is nice. You do get two cables. So you get a Type-C to Type-C cable for a power source if you need it. And then you also get a USB-A to Type-C to connect it to your other monitor or computer as well. And it does come with nice packaging as well. Everything's protected and you're ready to go out of the box. All right, so I actually just got it connected here to my Mac computer. So this is an all-in-one computer, so it's a little bit different. So I actually had to plug in a power source, but I plugged in the USB-A into the computer and then I plugged in the USB-C to USB-C into an outlet underneath this desk. So all you need is two plugs. Normally you just need one plug if it's just into a monitor. But as you can see, now I have it plugged in and look at that. You have a really nice screen now below here and I can go here to the top screen like this, like this, oh, like this right here. And I can type on here and look at that. It's right away. And so, and so it's really cool because you get a keyboard, but then you also get this screen right here. You know, if while you're working, you want to go down here, you want to watch movies and stuff. As you can see, I don't know if you can see the mouse here. I'll go below. And now I can scroll down here and now I basically have, you know, a portal monitor down here and my main computer up here, which is just super nice. And it is touchscreen as well. So if I want to go down here, let's see, I'll open up, you know, CapCut right here or my notes. I accidentally clicked this one right here. Let me cancel that. But if I want to open up, you know, CapCut to edit and stuff like that, I can just use the touchscreen like you can see here and I'll open it up. And here we go. Now I have my editing software down here and I can, you know, drag the clips if I want. I can use the touch screen. You know, if I wanted to go over here to effects or stickers, as you can see, I can just use the touch screen. Look at how responsive that is. And essentially I could, you know, I could move the clips. I can move the mouse down here with my hand. I could open up other applications, the notes app, anything like that. If I want open up the finder down here as well. And it's just super easy to move around as you see, I can click it. I can also, if I want, I can drag things up and down between the screens so I can drag it up here and look at how responsive that is. Is that not pretty awesome? So it's a really cool screen, honestly. It, it is really nice that it does have the touchscreen feature as well. And I do like that it is connected to the mouse pad. But besides that, something else you can do as well is you can actually change the color of the keyboard also. So if you hold down the FN button and then the escape button, you can actually switch it between different colors, which is kind of cool. You can do uh, this mode and you can make it switch to different colors automatically instead of just having one color. Or if you want, you can even hold the FN button like this. Let me see if I can hold the camera up while doing it. You can even hold the FN button like this and then you can hold these buttons over here, either the eight or the two, and you can adjust the brightness of it as well. So I'll make the brightness higher, make it lower, you can completely adjust that as well, which is another cool feature this has. So overall, as far as my just thoughts and opinion on this, I think it is an awesome screen. The touch screen is very responsive. It is really big as well. And it's just nice to have a little screen underneath your screen here that you can have that's a touch screen. So it just makes it easier to work, you know, to have your editing thing up here and kind of your notes or other things up here, depending on how you want to configure it. And you know, you do have those cool features with the lights as well that you can adjust. I do think it would be nice if this screen was completely detachable from the keyboard if you wanted to. Um, cause you can't really take this apart, but it is cool that it does have the keyboard. However, I think it would be nice if you could detach it. But other than that, it's an awesome product. It works great. And it's really responsive to your computer or monitor that you already have. So, 
So if you guys are looking for another monitor, you know, one of these smaller ones or thinner designs that you can put underneath your other monitor, your other computer, definitely recommend checking this out. It's a pretty cool option in my opinion.